Acceptance is the most overrated thing in today's generation. We force ourselves to be these characters, these personalities, because some of us are afraid of not being accepted. I know I am. I act like I don't care about other people's opinions, but in all honesty, I'm terrified. I'm so scared that my thoughts, my feelings won't be accepted. Even though this generation has the most open mind, I feel like people will come to a conclusion that I'm different, bad different. I feel like people will look down on me and put me in a situation where I can't learn more about myself. I sometimes wonder if my friends are just there because they feel sorry for me. I break down because I'm scared of losing the people that matter the most to me. There's so much going on in my head that I don't even know who I am anymore. I lost myself. That is, until I watched the film called Love, Simon. This film is about a closeted gay 17 year old who is trying to find himself while keeping his sexuality a secret. When I was watching the film, the entire time I imagined myself in a situation where his mother, his father, even his friends didn't even know about his secret. Nobody knew. Until he was forced to come out. There was a scene where he talked to his mother about his sexuality. And I cried through that entire scene. I imagined my mother and I having that conversation. And the funny thing was, my mother was literally sitting right next to me. She was holding my hand that entire time through that scene. We were both crying because we imagined each other in that situation. A mother having to come to terms with the sexuality of her son. A son coming to his mother. Then came the scene with the father. I could only relate to it a little bit because I never knew my father. I actually saw my brother and I in that predicament, which made me cry even more. My brother is the world to me. He's one of the most important figures in my life because he knows who he is and what he wants to do. We fight and we argue, we laugh and we smile. In the end, we're brothers and I would shatter if I never had his acceptance. He's one of the only people that has opinions that I listen to. In the end of that scene, the father does accept the son and I imagine my brother fully accepting me for who I am. And guess what? I cried. That's going to be a reoccurring theme in this letter. <laughs> then comes the end of the movie where the protagonist gets his happily ever after and all is well. I happily cried and saw how peaceful the protagonist was. After the movie was over and I returned to my house, I went into my room and, you guessed it, I cried. A lot. I cried because after the whole movie I felt at peace. I finally saw a movie that I can actually relate to. Something that represents my life in a nutshell. I looked at myself in the mirror and said, I'm okay. I continued saying that over and over like a mantra until I said one thing that made me smile so much. I'm gay. I finally did it. I finally accepted myself for who I was. I let my emotions and my feelings take over and felt at peace. I let my true self in and got the results I've been wanting for over six years. In that moment, I realized that I really don't need anyone's acceptance but my own. If you don't like me for the fact that I'm homosexual, I wouldn't really give a fuck. Because self-acceptance is what matters when it comes to being different. I was going to focus on my happiness before I let anyone bring me down. And whoever is listening to this shouldn't either. Therefore, the next few things I'm about to say is about to get emotional AF. Dear you, you deserve happiness. You deserve acceptance. You deserve anything that your heart desires because you are the best you there is. Don't let anyone change that. You are special to me, to your family, and to your friends. Fuck whoever pushes you to be something you're not. Fuck whoever doesn't accept you for being you. They don't matter. They will never matter. Because you should be focused on one thing. Yourself. Go talk to that person you've had a crush on for months on end. Go join a club that you love. Go do something that benefits you. Accept your feelings, your thoughts, your emotions. Accept your whole body. You are nothing but a beautiful, loving person who needs to 
understand that self-acceptance is the only acceptance that matters. Then, when you've accepted yourself, be surrounded by people who accept you. Cherish them, hold them close, and never let go. Those are the people that matter. If you feel lost or worthless, talk to them. Let them know what's on your mind because if you bottle it up, you'll never be truly happy. I know that firsthand. Accept yourself. Love yourself. Be who you are. If you feel like you're alone, know that you're never alone. Your family and friends are rooting for you. And even though I don't know who you are, I'm rooting for you. You deserve a great story. Love, KJ, CJ Tyrant. P.S. You should definitely check out Love Song. It was mainly the inspiration I got to write this. But I bet you won't cry as much as I did though.